What's up, world? You know what day it is. You know what time it is. It's Tuesday. You know what that is. That's impeachment, American crime story. Episode nine. Boy, I can do. This episode pretty much focuses on, like, I guess, like, the day or a, a week after uh, the whole Bill Clinton um, court date. Um, it opens up with Monica going into the uh, whole courtroom and asking her questions about the whole relationship with her, her and Bill. And Monica, like, she's trying to play, like, hey, can I know the name? Like, y'all, we really can't do that. Safety reasons. And... The majority of the it was it was one of the things where excuse me it was one of the things where it was one of the things where it was a lot it was some black jurors on here like black women on there and they were asking they were they, they were asking the hard hitting questions the hard hitting questions and it was a point where they like they had to go for a break recess. For like 10 minutes, they came back. They started asking her more questions about why she did this, about the tie. No, no, that was that was later on. But like they were just asking a lot of questions. And they asked her why did she not leave the court. Leave the, uh, so it's like, yo, they, so they, read, they, uh, they got her. The FBI pulled up on you at the, at the food court. And they went upstairs to the court, to the, um, to the hotel room. And they said you could leave. And she was explaining everything. Like they were like, they were like, huh? They were like, why didn't you leave? But then they like, they were like, they were like, you knew they, were, they, they knew like they they played you, and it's because they they played off your fear of being scared. And like, I, it's like I was scared. I knew what they was gonna do. They was talking about him and my whole family, of my mom up and everything. So she was scared about that, and. She was like, you could tell Monica, like, and like, yo, you, and the, and, the, and the, this other older black lady, she was like, yo, she was like, yo, you, you didn't think what she was doing was wrong. You was mad, messing with a married man, and you didn't see nothing wrong with what she was doing. And Monica, like, yeah, she messed with a married man before. She didn't want to, she, she was not trying to do it again, and all this stuff, right? And they moved. And that's when it started getting real serious. That's when it got into the whole, um, it got to the whole, uh, the question about the whole hotel thing. Fast forward, it goes to Linda's portion. And, oh, they was grilling Linda. They were just giving her the business. Like, Linda was on the road, was getting hot, just getting hemmed up. Like, they was throwing everything at, like, yo, and she was calling you. Why didn't you just like, yo, man, stop calling me? And Linda was like, no, before that, you know how I do on these damn things. She was like, she asked for some files and then give it to us. Like, yo, they're out to get me, yada, yada, yada. And she goes back to the Pentagon to talk to the guy. She's like, these aren't the files I asked for. These aren't what I... And before that, her daughter, when she was at home, she's like, yo, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm getting all over the place. It opens up with them. I don't know where she's at. She was at some hotel, and everybody was looking at Linda like, "Yo, that's Linda, that's Linda, that's Linda." That's Linda. Everybody, and she gave this black lady like she was making a waffle, and she was like, <sighs> "Turn the dance." She was like being real, real like a douche to the lady. Like, oh, and the black lady would sit down like, "Yo, that's Linda, that's Linda." You know. And she was just Linda Tripp. She was just knocking back slim fast by the heaps. Like, she was knocking back slim fast, TV dinners, chain smoking. But I had to throw that in the mix. But what got me was Linda in her own sick mind. Like, she think, thought she was doing the right thing. And when it was questioning, like, yo, I was scared after the gentleman that, you know, in the beginning, you know, And she like she she said she feared for her life and everything. She didn't know what they were gonna do. And then like and, the, and this one guy like, you going off of what? What did you? Oh, there was closed. People were talking behind closed door like, like all this behind like you don't even. They were like 
you tripping, like, you paranoid, like, you know, they were like, they were really like, son, and I'm like, yo, get your scary cell phone, that's pretty much how they were looking at it, and so, moving forward, I'm like, they were questioning Monica, no, then Bill, you know, he, this is where, whoo, every man, he called, uh, Hillary into the office, he starts like going full blown Usher confession, like just going in, like, uh, this is the reason I did this. And Hillary just like, she like, she did, she did with the bird man, you finish or you done. You know, hit it with the embacle, how oh, you done? She hit it with the embacle, how oh, you done? And like, I love you. All right, all right, I'll holler at your play, boy. You be good now. Walked off. Ooh, she hit it with the, ooh, yeah, like, I done told y'all this. I don't get, I don't get nothing but, like, nope. And it was just all down here. And then, it's just one of the things, like, then, poor Paula Jones. Paula Jones, she just, it's Paula Jones. She got a nose job, her husband tripping, and he that that fool out for money. You could tell he out for fame. Her husband out for fame. Paula Jones' husband was out for fame. That's what he was out of. He he was trying to become famous. That's what he was trying to do. But at the end of it all, the same lady that um, they went to see like about two episodes ago, um, because this next week is the season finale. And um, we're going to talk about that later. She said that they were like, question her again. Like, did this really happen? Did you lie? And it ends like, the guy came and like, he, she said, he did this. And the guy like, so, she's like, you really bringing this to me? A woman that said one thing, she changed the story. This is, I don't believe what she's saying. And the dude like, all right. And... I want to end the video like this. You end up, Monica is really, after all this, she's still holding Bill down. And the thing that they have the subpoena, what is it, a subpoena? Because she's on oath. I think that is what it was. Um, she said, what did y'all do? And she was telling about the sexual encounters. And the thing that she said Bill did, it was a, all I could say, it was a cigar. And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> These are some freaks. I'm like, what? What she said, this, they did with a cigar is just like, yo. I've thought, I've heard it all. And she said, woo, man. If you saw the show, you know what I'm talking about. In the comments, <laughs> All I gotta say, the people that saw the show know what I'm talking about. But the whole, all I can say was that take close, but no cigar to a whole nother level. That's all I gotta say. It take it to a whole nother level. But in closing, American Impeachment American Crime Story Episode 9 Grand Jury was a great episode. Because it's kind of like. Somebody said it in the, on Twitter. They said it on Twitter. And it's, it gives you the whole people versus OJ vibes. Because the court scene makes you start feeling for Monica more and more and more. Like, yo. And, and Hillary also. But more like Monica. Like, yo. I, it's like, dang. Like, how can one man abuse his power like this? Like, you're the most powerful man in the world, and you just, that's crazy. In the comments, let me know what y'all thought of today's epi tonight's episode. Thumbs up the video. And let me know, let me know what y'all, because this next week is the season finale. So we're going to talk more about that. But um, 
Man, what an episode. I'm out. Peace.